Welcome back to the broadcast. And of course, it's back to Football Friday. And we're here at Valley Ranch at the practice facility for the Cowboys with Charlotte Jones Anderson. We talked about this great new apparel you guys have. Everyone's ready for the game on Sunday. But you guys have really started doing something special with your Five Points Blue initiative, right? Tell me about that. You know, we are so excited to launch this new website because we really felt like we needed to show a side and offer a side of the Cowboys that a lot of people really want to see, but they never get that glimpse, you know, behind the curtain to see what what really happens back here. But also to launch a website that really speaks from a female voice about all the things we love about football because we are avid fans. We love this game, but just imagine kind of um, a lifestyle website where you get real hardcore news, but you, but you get it in a way that is quick because you're running out the door, you're going to the office, you want to speak intelligently, you love football, but you also want to know what to make for the tailgate party that night. I love it. And what's so great about this, I mean, and it's really kind of interesting that you you guys are the first to do this when, you know, everything is telling us that the NFL's fan base is the female fan base is close to 50 percent, right? It is. Forty-five percent of the fans that follow the NFL are female. Oh. And so we have, clearly, we have a voice, we have a presence, and now it's time to really embrace that and, and give people what they're looking for, what they want, and alternatives. Because a lot of people don't want the same thing, but they want something new, they want something different, and they want to be able to engage. You know, we love the social media, we love the content, we want to talk to our kids about it, our friends about it, or be impressive you know at the water cooler at work with the knowledge that we have so hopefully this site will engage everyone in that way and it's definitely engaging the people here a another labor of love where you've really gotten your female family members here yes. at the Cowboys yes. to get on board and everyone in some way shape or form is going to contribute to this website yes. right this is what is so great this has really been an organic effort for us so we have over 150 female employees in all walks of life and everything that we do that touch from the stadium to merchandising to football and we brought every together and said hey you know what, what do you want to know about your team we're all passionate about the game we all have have different things that we want to know and different things that intrigue us so let's bring all those ideas together and offer them out to all of our fans across the country well and as a retired football wife one of the things I always love to hear about is what the wives are doing and you yes. guys will talk about the wives association and a lot of the great work they're doing in the community right absolutely and they are such an important part of our organization and they do so much many great things and it's so interesting you know we want to know what they're what they're making their spouse for breakfast before they show up for work you know we, we want to know a lot of interesting facts about them about their pets about their family just all of that and they're excited to be able to share and I think we're excited to be able to learn more Ooh, behind the scenes with the Cowboys wives yes. I think that's pretty fun um, and you guys do a lot of explaining of maybe some things on the website if you're not really familiar with a lot of football terms y'all had a big signing this week and so a lot of people may have heard a lot of women may have heard of the practice squad right. for the first time this week and so you guys will take some time to explain what a practice squad is mm -hmm. stuff of that nature right exactly you know we've got a word of the day which is great and so hopefully we'll begin to educate more and more and there's a lot of our fans that already know that so there's also content on there that takes them deeper into it but probably in a quicker way mm -hmm. than our website so this should be a, a great compliment to the content that we already give on DallasCowboys.com, but give it in a way that we think is quick and easy and fun and exciting to be a part of. And also interactive with the fans, because if yes. the fans are posting pics from the game on Sunday, if they're tweeting you, they may end up on the website as well? Absolutely, and that's why we want everybody to take their favorite photo of themselves getting ready for the game and, and tweet at us and hashtag Five Points Blue, and we're going to post a fan gallery of the game, so your pictures will be up there, and we really want to build a community. This is what it's all about. Social media is about sharing. It's about celebrating together, and that's what we hope to do. I love it. Well, the season's here. Big game yes. Sunday. Yes. What are your thoughts? Give us some insight into what fans can expect on Sunday. You know, that is always the question, right, is, is how's the game going to go on Sunday? Well, we're very excited about um, the progress that we've made in the offseason. Clearly, we've had a lot of challenges and obstacles to overcome. Uh, we think that we're going to field and go out and fight and give an awesome game and I think that um, our players are ready you know training camp is long yes, and the process is. to get there is is grueling so now it's time to come and 
and show up the game and, and do some big things. So I, I think we'll be excited about what we see and hopefully celebrate a lot of victories. This is where all the hard work comes together. Thank you so much for being here with us Thank today. You, for you know I'm a Cowboys fan. You know where my loyalties lie, so I'll be cheering on Sunday too. Great. great. All right. Thank see you then. so much for joining uh -huh. us. We appreciate it. We've got more broadcasts when we come back. Maybe the chefs from so-and-so are here cooking up something in our Sub-Zero Wolf Bentwood kitchen. Come on back.